Hey, as a realtor, how did your 2020 work out for you? I think for most Americans, 2020 was a year of extremes. And that was even more true for realtors. And with social distancing restrictions, many years experienced full or partial bans on open houses. With so many families experienced financial uncertainty, there were fewer homes on the market, inventory was scarce. Many realtors failed to represent even the sale of one single home. But on the flip side, mortgage rates, oh my gosh, they've never been lower. New home builds set records month after month after month. Homes sold in record time, usually well above asking price. And most of the realtors I work with and mentor, they've had record years, earning more money and fewer hours than ever before. So yes, 2020 was certainly a year of extremes for realtors. Now the question is this, what is your 2021 gonna look like? Now I've been a realtor for close to 20 years now. And although I've obviously never seen COVID before, I've seen similar trends. So as a realtor, I predict that whatever you experienced in 2020, you can expect more of that in 2021. Now this is great news for the realtors who did well in 2020, but it's pretty daunting for the realtors who struggled. My advice for the realtors who weren't consistently earning at least 25,000 a month would be to stop doing what you've been doing. It just makes sense. If what you've been doing didn't work for you in 2020, then it certainly is not gonna work for you in 2021. This means you're gonna to wanna to stop circle prospecting, stop chasing FISBOs and expired, stop door knocking, stop paying for leads that don't work, stop hassling your friends and family, stop relying on social media to build your business. What you need to do instead is start focusing on the cool premium buyers and sellers that are shopping in the top 50% of your market's price point. Think about it. Who did COVID affect the most? It hurt the middle class. It hurt the people who were living paycheck to paycheck. The truth is that many of the wealthy Americans actually became wealthier because of COVID. Look at how the stock market has soared. Look at Peloton bikes. They're indoor bicycles. They have one wheel, a seat, some handlebars. They sold for over $2,000 and they've been sold out pretty much since the start of COVID. And for me personally, I always like driving the latest model Corvette. And I went in to buy a new Corvette this past summer. I was told there was a three year waiting list. What I'm trying to say is that the people with money, they still have money. And now, even more than ever, they want to spend it on housing. And these are the people shopping in the top 50% of your market's price point. They are the dream buyers and sellers you want to work with. These are the people who aren't going to haggle over a few dollars one way or the other. These are the people that are not going to fuss about a broken GFI outlet at the inspection. These are the people who are willing to pay what they need to pay to get what they want when they want it. This is why the realtors who focus on attracting the cool premium buyers and sellers who are shopping in the top 50% of their market's price point made so much money and had so much fun in 2020. These are the realtors who cannot wait to see more of the same in 2021. Life is only going to get better for those realtors. But for the realtors who will rely on social media, FISBOs, expireds, door knocking, weak leads, circle prospecting, it's going to be another bleak year as well going forward. Now, I don't think most realtors work with the bottom 50% of a price point on choice. I think it's because they're, they're just not ready to represent the higher priced homes or they don't know how to connect and attract the top 50%. So here's the great news. There's actually 11 different ways to attract really cool premium buyers and sellers that I teach. And seven of the 11 ways cost less than 200 a month to implement. And none of them take more than a couple hours per week to actually do. And all of these 11 ways work for realtors regardless of experience in their market they find themselves in. So it's worked for an 18 year old college student. It's worked for an 80 year old realtor with over 20 years experience. The complete proven simple signature system has worked in all 50 states and in Canada. So the question is, do you want what happened to you in your real estate business in 2020 to carry on into 2021? Or do you wanna flip the script and start focusing on the top 50% of the market 
that is going to describe as easy, lucrative, and fun. And so if you want to focus on these buyers and sellers in the top 50%, and if you want your homes to sell in record time above asking without headaches, then you want to implement my complete proven simple signature system or CPS3 for short. Simply sign up for my upcoming live three-day event and let me give you absolutely everything you need to make your 2021 the best year ever. A year that adds 300,000 or more to your bank account by working with cool premium buyers and sellers that are easy, lucrative, and fun to work with. So click the link and I'll show you how to start loving being a realtor again.